First of all, you should solo cast this game while I get so, changed and go to the toilet. Yeah, sure. That's right. Two minutes. And then, after this map, I'm gonna need to go for dinner. But you could run map two by yourself as well. <laughs> okay, buddy, I'm gonna do it. This is gonna be horrible because I want to take from both. Um. I'm finding I have too much of your face in my room at the minute, because not only is the stream going, but also the export of the Seattle phase match. <laughs> too pride is always too much. Yes. I'd argue even half a pride is too much at some point. I ended up using the stream as a focus outlet while thinking about the way I should uh, elaborate on me choosing not to do an overnight. So, you're, you're telling me you didn't commentate on anything? <laughs> no comment. No you're comment <laughs> dating. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> Alright. That's gonna be a fun one. Maybe Kieran's gonna have to do a voiceover. <laughs> for, for, for the other. I mean, hey, Williams has been popping how am I, up. How am I meant to leave you for an entire search and destroy map as well? I left you for like nah, the first Williams quarter of the whole point. going a whole 59 10, bro. I've, I've been spectating the right, the right dude. You didn't even switch player earlier. What am I gonna do here? It's Vegas in the lead, apparently. Aquilar with the double loot might get them off the time. Never mind, he'll rotate it. Okay, we go to new, and no one's really close to it. But 
Boston, well, Boston are going to have to deal with that number six, which is Williams, who has been the star player so far for Vegas. And they do deal with him. And that's going to be Boston back in the time. Back trying to regain in this hard point. But it's close. It's very close. Uh, and, I mean, I'm not surprised. This is too tightly contested teams in terms of how they've performed this weekend. I'd say this weekend, this tournament. Well, that's going to be scrap time, I believe. Going well. I mean, it's trades towards the scrap time, but it's going to be Vegas still with a lead. And New Hill... It's gonna be somewhere. It's back to P1. Okay. And P1, I believe, was very scrappy last time. They're all shooting said. at each other. Don't tell George. Wait, is George in this match? Oh god, yeah, of course he is. I mean, I'm not surprised we're shooting each other when George is in the same. George has a habit of it. How many kills? George is 20 and 13, bro. You cannot be funny. Wait, what? <laughs> you cannot be 21 of her, you cannot be <laughs> putting shade on his name. Bro, George, bro. He, he's, he's woke up. He's ready to get more, bro. Watch this. Never. Holy! The other demon. Yeah, Williams. I mean, the fact that this power point is only halfway there in score. And Williams has already broke the 20 mark, and George has already broke the 20 mark. I'm very scared to see where this kills count is going to end up at. Vegas in at P2. Alvarez with a swing. Vegas able to hold for now, but George should be there to pick up some scraps. He finds Kutcher. And cock on the Aguilar, though. And Vegas, a brilliant job of holding that hill. Great job, shoving them down. Shabbard tried to get aggressive there on the spawn up. Doesn't really work out for him, and he spawns all the way out to the side of the map. Kutcher with another one. Stun coming in from Alvadrez. Might have hit somebody. Hard to tell. Alvadrez didn't know who to shoot. Is Hancock still going? Is Hancock on a streak? Is he streaking out right now? What are we, what are we talking for the Hancock streak? Because he's still going. He's finally dead. Oh, well, I didn't give him a chance there, did I? <laughs> Well, I gave you like a full 10 seconds to check, but goddamn. 10 seconds, bro! I, I don't, I, I don't ah, know. Yeah, it was, yeah, it was close enough. You know what, boys? Let's learn to count and carry. Wow. I mean, Dang. if it wasn't 10, it was at least 5. Three. Okay, that's more like <laughs> There's enough, there's enough time for Brian to react to words. You've got to consider that because my brain is so slow, it was more akin to 1 second. <laughs> I'm aware of that, but I tried. Obviously, how long you had was completely out of my control. I had to hope Hancock just kept going. Go, Hancock! There after you go, it's on a zero strong, streak again. After a strong P2, Boston are coming in with the reply. Go, Shabu! Go, Shabu! Free streak! Have we got any 30 bombs yet? Um. George is pretty close, and George is pretty close. Williams is catching up. I think our record is 34? It's either 31 or 34. Boston into time in the new hill, and Boston are going to retake the lead in this hard point. It has been back and forth all map long. But normally this hill's a lot more contested than the previous two. And it's a matter of who can control that contest. Shabbat bro, that is a door. I've just witnessed Alvadrez spawn up and flash himself. Fucking George's Gillish suit is working a little too well today. George Williams on a 29. Series, so he's decided to George on a 29. Who's going to get it first? Williams has falls. got the 30 bomb first. Williams, Williams, Williams. That's a great hill from Boston. God, this is so balanced. You know, they, had, they had three down at a time. 
but they held off, and I don't think Vegas got any time out of that last hill, and now they're set up in kitchen, and we have seen some strong kitchen holds. And I believe they can win it here, but just a brief contest is all Boston are going to need, and there it is. The brief contest, and they do more than that, actually. George gets the break for a brief second, and a couple of, couple of ticks going his way, as Vegas flood on back in with a double. It's four Boston head are going to have to match. regroup here. Four head hour of the match. Four head. Five head plays from Hancock with a double. And now he's dead. Alvarez finds one himself, and I mean, there's about 50 million hit markers going in and there, but somehow Williams finds two. Remember, I don't understand how he's lived through all that. Oh, George with two. Who's on the most now? Still Williams down. Bro does not care. This looks like it's going to come back down to a P1, ladies and gentlemen. It's 170 to 181. Back to P1. It's Vegas in there for now. Williams, Williams lighting up the kill feed with three. Chabot with a fourth. Aguilar's in behind, but Kutcher gets the trade, and it's time back the way of Vegas. George with a double. Can we get any more 30 bombs before the game? Here comes, here comes the Boston refrag. Alvarez with a throwing knife, and there's the break. And now Boston can win it here. Oh. Vegas need to contest. Go on, Aguilar. You're going to be the next one to reach the 30. I believe in you. How much ammo have you got? You've got 35 bullets. Here. Don't be low. Of Drez Falls. There you Boston go. Can't win it here. This is still Vegas' Aguilar. chance. Aguilar with a double, though. And that's going to shut down any Vegas hopes. And it's going to be on to the rotation. Vegas might have the spawns. You can rotate, rotate. Here comes the Boston. A Boston have three dead, and that might be the big difference maker. Oh, it's a two. contest. It's a big gunfight. Kutcher with a win. It's that man. The man of the hour. He gets traded by George Hancock. Picks up Aguilar. Alvarez in behind. Oh, well, he's going to see Boston in here. No. Somebody stop him. Trades favor Vegas. And can Boston get there in time? No, they can't. No. Las Vegas Legion win an absolute barn burner. Boston! An absolute barn burner of a Boston! first round. Those two teams were right beside each other the entire way. The entire way. Boston! Any, they said anything you can do, I can do better. As we see 38 and 27 come out from Williams. 37 and 30 from George. Aguilar gets a 30 bomb to match. All oh, right. Oh, that was quick. Um, I loaded in just about as quick as the boss. I've opened up my window. Maybe get some better ventilation. That might help. We've got a 2-2 split for the defense. Um... Yeah, I just pick one. I think that leaves us with the usual. Uh, no, it's a 3v3. That's a 3v2. There we go. No, it makes more sense. That's because the bomb carrier is stuck over here. Uh, interesting. I don't care though. Uh,. It's a really unfortunate series of events, but I don't really know if I can care to keep track of this and actually um, put it right to make it fair for these guys. Oh, they've learnt of each other. I think I give this one to Mia Shiro. Las Vegas Legion are going to get the first round. They're going to get it anyway because um, Kalsa is unable to plant the bomb, but that's uh, fine. That is fine by me. Mia Shiro certainly put on the performance for that one. I think it's well deserved if I let things go the way they're gonna go here, which is Kalsa just being unable to plant the bomb and Mia Shiro getting the first round. For the Las Vegas Legion, as much as I do want Boston Breach to win, if I'm honest. 
Oh, I bet the butt chin. Chin butt. Butt chin, chin butt. I like my chin butt. <laughs> this is content. I'm thinking of giving this one to Mia Shero for his n nice little two piece and the fact that, the, you know, Castle just cannot plan. I'm just gonna let things go the way they are, so way they are going, because I can't be able to keep track, and Mia Shiro is a badass. It is really dark. I look like a ghost. versus all. No, he's blind! Let's shoot! Ah, oh, unlucky. It's a 3v3 though, better than most situations. It's deep in. Oh, kinda late with the switch there. Kalsa can clutch this up, easy. There we go, it's a 1v1. Ah, McKay beats him to the floor though, that's unlucky. I like this song. Gabe with his only kill manages to get a clutch. Bro do it like you do it. Bro is playing like you do what he's doing. I must say Karen, the fact that nobody decided to take my 9 to 5 says quite a lot about how fucked it is to do a 9 to 5. Um, it does say a lot indeed. I mean, other than the actual st store owner saying, hmm, should probably be doing this. But I feel like if anyone wanted to actually do it, they would have They'd have at least been like, hey, can I then? But some people do be wanting that normal night's sleep. I do be quite, I, I am quite, oh, they've just won the round already, just like that, um, I am quite, even if I can't cast the game, I can still talk about something, so, um, I am pretty bad with, like, uh, my sleep compared to normal people, because, oh, I wonder why, um, but, like, this also makes you super tired, oh, uh, <laughs> shut it, um, I am pretty bad with my sleep compared to normal people, so if- Oh, McCarthy, like I said, I was gonna say, you can't be majestic for my horrible casting. Um... Yeah, like, I am pretty bad compared to normal people with my sleep, uh, so, like... I was saying, if normal people don't even want to pick up this chest, then that's, like, really bad rep for the 9-to-5s. Would consider getting them off my schedule. But I also know I'll have to have the talk with, um... In fact, I think I've already attempted, but my manager was just like, Hmm, I'm not sure if I'm gonna do that one for you, I can't lie. Oop, that's is that diffuse happening? Not quite, apparently. Now it's happening. Um, but yeah, my manager was like, mm, not happy. But that's like the life of someone with a minimum hours contract. Like, you can't just ch change your availability like significantly without the talk. That's basically almost the same. Right? Apparently, we're not gonna get a quick 2 0 from the like, region here. I mean, it still might be relatively quick, but it's not happened yet. I mean, they really are just, you know, your average normal business talk, so like, none of this is unique. 
Just uh, usual, hey, should you be doing this? Hey, this isn't fun. Hey, I'm not sure if I want to do that because I kind of need this. Um, only thing is, in my attempt to fix my sleep schedule, I've made it mwah, perfect right before I have to do another overnight. And then it has to be perfect way quicker than I can have it to be perfect again. So that's gonna. This is just a whole. What a nade, bro. What the fuck? Through the smoke, pretty much. Um. Oh, we can't have Las Vegas Legion taking this one. Is that. No, Briar! Briar, no! I can't be happening. Alright, we're, we're, we're relegating Pryor. I don't want to see him again. That's too old. Too old to Las Vegas, to my knowledge. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Pryor needs a Pryor needs a new headset. You can't be playing with a headset that you just can't hear people. And the guy on the team with the best stats as well. Like, mm, a regular future potential uh, that McDonald's likes. Um, I'm definitely not looking forward to waiting an absurd amount of time to inherit the role of a business manager from, uh, which is, I think is pretty chancy from some of the older workers. Uh, it's definitely not something I'm looking forward to. I mean, it's not bad salary. I think it, you can get better just by picking up another trade though. Uh, which is what I'm mainly trying to get into right now, like plumbing or um, electrical installation sound a bit more for me. Uh, Las Vegas are being punished for their attempts on A here. Oh no, he's trying to capture A and he's, he's quite succeeding. Just with him by himself. But yeah, I'm trying to get into a trade. At least then I can have normal hours. Um, I'll still have to work. I will have to work 40 hours a week at the bare minimum, even if I did succeed in picking one up. But it's gonna be a while before I have that opportunity, like definitely set out for me. I feel like the closest opportunity is also like really far away. Uh, something I need a car for. I don't think I'm gonna have a car before that opportunity is really hit or miss. Missed. So I could be going a while where. Um, I'm really struggling with my money to get a car. No, um, not really that. Um, yeah, no, because I've got to learn how to drive. But that's gone. That's gone smoothly. Like, it'll be done within uh, the year, I'm thinking. Uh, especially if I pick up um, a second set of lessons, which I do. So I'll be done that quickly. I don't know if I'll get this apprenticeship. I'd like to get it sooner, but it'd be really stressful to do without a car. Um, that's my thought process. Uh, and it looks like Boston Bridge are going to take this first round. It's going to be something we're not used to here for um, the semi final so far. Boston Bridge actually doing something. <laughs> um, especially taking the initiative is something I'm not expecting to see from them either. But back to my point. Um, I don't think 40 hours a week either, like, the long travel time of 40 hours a week being something that I'm not really used to going for is going to be, like, something really stressful for me. But the normal sleep hours is going to be something good. I don't have to work an entire year on that bare minimum wage, though. Like, they don't owe me nothing. They can do their bare minimum apprenticeship wage legally until I've done my first year. Which is really horrendous. Um, and when I have to work that much, I'll have to really, like... I'll probably just have to full on like consider not even do my driving lessons quite a bit. I'd have to really start trying to get them um, bus passes. What the fuck? Wait, wait. Happening now. Um, <laughs> I 
I will all with the usual shout out. Uh, everything going as expected. But long travel times, um, large expenses, and uh, other things with the 40 hour work week on top of that, like, I'm gonna be a busy guy, like. Especially because it's a, ra a ratio with only 20% learning and improving on myself. And I'd be doing it for like the same amount of time no matter how long I did it anyway. I mean, like the, the best I could even argue for was to be to not be at, put on the absolute minimum wage. I don't think they'd be nice enough to do that for me though. Like an apprenticeship at 18 when I've got other things to be doing is going to be completely brutal. I want that all the way like super far away uh, on the outskirts of my city it's not much of an opportunity but that's why we keep looking as well because i'm just about to keep uh look again i think I think waiting another um, year until I've learned how to drive would really increase my opportunities. Um, I probably have a car in here as well. I'm not sure. I think in a lot of ways, I kind of want to be more financially secure, but it's not something that can happen. Las Vegas Legion with the advantage, and that was the win right there as well. I'll have a charger here for my phone. For the defense, two two split for the attack. Early picks typical of Aguilar. Some more early picks. Like how brutal can the start be? The cap on B really actually holding up the timer. Giving plenty of something time for something to happen on A, although I don't think it will. I don't think it will. Here's going on. Uh, we've got the live advantage. It's looking uh, pretty solid. It might stay solid. Uh, neither of them could get any bullets out. We're forced to go for the reload as well as while electrocuted, so they couldn't even reload if they wanted to. Uh, George is looking to be completely surrounded here. Complete just waste of a life. We're looking 19 to 19 now, quite even. I'm not sure if we have the time to play lives here. Like, so. The clock is ticking down, but it should be fine. Like, so. We're getting a lot of involvement here. And a lot of gunfights. Um, the point. 17 to 17, the, the time is really refusing to A lot of good throwing knives. Um, given still somewhat of an edge to Boston Breach. We've kept that somewhat long. Um, you can still say that, if, especially if you anticipate that Las Vegas were obviously going to win their attack. Um, as I say that though, I'm getting compl proved completely wrong. Or maybe not so much. Or maybe so much. Really could go either way this game. Um, you do have the first point bar of capture, which is a testament to how much time they've managed to take here while playing down the lives. Um, 
Oh, so show up to more passive players uh, down here. Unless there's more of an opportunity for a capture. Uh, I think Aguilar's presence on site is really kicking the bots into life, and it's gonna this contest here is gonna stop anything happening. Um, Hancock just refused to shoot Aguilar, and I think Aguilar's gonna be the second bar. Um, in fact, we could see a complete capture here. I, just, I don't really think the bots have any sense of danger here as the site just gets captured and captured uh, no complaints from me though i would love to see a boston breach victory and it looks like it may or may not happen um we've got cutter on site whittling down not even on site so he's not whittling down time. he has come to contest now against alvi dress um Breaking line of sight, Arbidrez almost puts the timer to zero. Uh, we've got some contestants here attempting to do that exact same thing. And accidentally stepping his foot onto the site, we have one of our Boston Breach fanatics manage to actually undo the tie to get a win. Aguilar with the rough final kill against. Well, I've already forgotten, I can't lie. Alright, now we've got a 3 1 split. Now, this guy down at B's gonna stop the time while these guys are gonna stay fighting for a while. We'll stop the time for significantly longer uh, while there's only one person on the point. A very developed, smart strategy, and I really don't see why the fuck Karen can't just join my party. That's a real big disappointment from Karen right there. Now, Karen, we've been talking about how the strategy of having a 3 1 split for keeping the time down, but. Um, while still playing the point, whittling down the lives seems to be a very good um, timekeeping strat strategy for Boston Breach. I talking strategies. Yeah, yeah. I think I think that free one actually split. actually commenting on the match. Yeah, I think that's free one split's very um, smart thing to do because while you can contest that point and keep the timer running down, uh, stop the timer from running down, you also capture it as slow as possible. Um, which I just completely adds way more to the timer. And as if Las Vegas Legion hadn't already gotten two points on A, we might see a complete twist here. Like, it just seems to be Legion for days here. We, we, Boston Breach don't stand a chance, to put it bluntly. But they need to stand a chance, because, I mean, if they lose this, they're right. They get 3 0 I'm seeing... And out of all the teams you'd think we're going to get 3 0 it would not be Boston. There's nothing they can do here. I'm pretty sure Las Vegas are going to be on the attack. Has it been, has it been offense every round? Has offense won every single round or has defense won a couple? Uh, offense has won every round in this hotel. Okay, well then the big question is who gets offense this round? Probably Las Vegas Legion. Switching sides? Oh, okay. And then that means that Boston are gonna get it. Do we just get a free Boston win here? Through look of the It might be. Draw? I mean Las Vegas. Well no, it's it's it's, it's not luck of the draw. It does actually it does actually have uh What's the kill count? Go to the kills. Uh just six switch. eighteen. Right, you count you count no you count Vegas because I can't see Vegas, I'll count Boston. Oh, okay. Eighteen, twenty nine. 49 for Las Vegas Legion. Yeah, Boston only have 43, and they still got offense. Damn. Oh, no, I think because oh time. yeah, no no no, it's whoever gets most ticks gets defense, and if then the ticks the ticks have drawn. Yeah, and then it goes to most kills. So because Vegas actually got more kills, they get dealt 
what would have thought to be the good hand if it was any map other than hotel but well no it, it's it's the good hand in any aspect that isn't the bot league and it is real life yeah, well, the, good hand. <laughs> <laughs> the bot league does not follow real life. The good hand con the good hand in terms of COD developers has only been playing in that game. Well no, but it does make sense. Control is defense sided in a in a realistic world. It's always defense sided. What would you say? That's a B capture for Boston, and it's going to be all down to A. Vegas with a couple of lives in the advantage. But, I mean, it's going to have to be a good hold. As usual, Vegas completely blown us out of the water here. Showing us why. This completely attack sided map is no longer attack sided Oh my god, Vegas. okay. Vegas just got like a rolling 7 feed. They're still going. We've got a team total of her about. A 15 streak on it? No, oh, I can't fucking do hey, 12 streak. Sure. Hopefully, we can get some of these re streaks re especially on Williams. There we go. We might actually Boston be able to that. Oh, okay, that, that could be all they need to be fair. A dead Williams is. Oh, yeah, something this, this, this could be tough. Williams already made the, his way back, and as if Cushion. Yeah, yeah exist, bro, look at those. Look at those spawns, though, for Vegas. They're, oh my god, the fact Vegas have made it even that problematic, and they're spawning that far away. Okay, okay. W bot league? I don't see anything they can do here, unfortunately, for... Yeah, that's it. What is that? They Boston did survived. everything that could be done. Yeah, and it's just offense dominated in that control. Boston are able to. There are Love that a from lot Boston. of opportunities here for. Trip. Yep. Damn, bro. I don't think people hated to... overnight that badly. Especially coming from the same people who, and I quote, didn't. It would do even an overnight with the amount of hours they've got. Uh, maybe my boss um, discouraged everyone from doing it by simply asking the question, are you really staying consistent? Even though the answer is obviously yes, it's just this is an exception time. Damn, fucking hell. But I don't know. It's very possible. Very possible to bot. Put everybody off. A bot? A boss. No, no one's even taking an ASAP shift to 2 a.m. That's like, anyone can do that. Anyone, like, even if, like, anyone would take that. So the fact that no, I don't, I, just no one's available for Monday for some reason. That's crazy. Damn, bro. All the people who are suddenly desperate for shifts are just suddenly no longer desperate for shifts. All the people that needed the money to sell it. Suddenly, don't no longer need the money. Mm -hmm. They must have won the lottery or something. <laughs> God damn. Yeah, do we have a muck lottery going on over here? Muck, muck, <laughs> muck lottery. Muck economical muck support going on. Uh, <laughs> running on the That's stretching up. <laughs> I, I don't That's think a it full is. 56 for Boston to kick us off. I mean, P2 meta, go, go, bro. Uh, Everyone loves a good P2 meta. Did you even I love it, game? you love it, we all love it. Peak 2 matter. Oh yeah, you did, because I thought you died. So. I was like, I, I didn't join, I just kind of went into the next. Oh yeah, no, I joined in the middle of map 3. Oof. I'll be dressed for that one in the morning. I think um, today is going to be a, a day of work for me where I do the bare minimum. Which is good because a lot of people do the bare minimum other than the people who just want the shift to go fast. Like, how do I put it? Like, 
<laughs> the people that do the most depend uh depending on the where they work. For a lot of people, that isn't too Could much. For me, in? when I do the most, I literally go from station to station doing everyone else's work. When I should really just focus on what I'm doing. And just take it step by step, if that makes sense. Like, I'm just... witnessing some questionable things from Kutcher. I'm thinking if the front counter needs a manager to come on, so I can not put in too much work, then so be it, kind of thing. Instead of me trying to do everyone's jobs and just doing the most out that wouldn't be too much of a break. That's like just being normal. I'm just in the mood to be a to be a normal person. There's no evil thing to work. That's with. rare from you. Yeah, there's no need for me to do an for, for, to do the most every day. Lead change. Get hype. Vegas have the lead for the first time in the series. Even though we are understaffed, so it would be expected of me to work somewhat hard anyway. As we rotate over to the bar. Da bar. Da Boston in there. Jabbert, well, actually, Jabbert was there first, but Boston. Shut him down. Okay, finally some Boston action, but there's still a contest going on here. You say finally, like they weren't 50 odd nothing up, you know? Yeah, but to go from 50 odd nothing up, whatever that means, to 70 70 is. I'm getting a lot of defamation flashbacks here. <laughs> <laughs> I'm getting, getting a lot of defamation flashbacks. I'm seeing a lot of segregation flashbacks. Yeah, that, that's fairly more up your straight. I mean, with the comments you make. Yeah, you better add that little, last little bit. <laughs> I know, I was really, really scared at the first part of that sentence that came out of my mouth. And I am so glad that I was able to save it as quick as I did. Yeah. You... Thank you. I will, I, a, this, I will accept this Oscar. That's a fair enough clutch right there. That's a clutch or clutch. That's a, that is Speak a of the devil. I, I, I put respect for that clutch. Kill Vegas looking for the break, but right now it ain't coming. Even though they have three dead, the point is still Boston's up until... Well, I mean, it's still trades. Boston are getting the close spawns. And Sorry, they're going to be able to contest this. You can hear a Spanish guy downstairs. A Scottish guy. A Spanish? What? Scotland! I'm from Scotland. Oh, I didn't mean to get this a aerial view. Oh, Skycam. Let's go. Okay. We will we, we will do it. Oh, oh, we're inside the map. We will do a Skycam for this site. Oh, wait. We're missing out on half the action. <laughs> there we go. I'm from the Is that any different to your normal casting? Missing out on half the action, like, I mean... True, there's no necessary L being taken here. We're just flying about in the Forward in map 4 of our second semi-final. We move, we move to a balcony hardpoint that is the most impenetrable hardpoint in the history of hardpoints, apparently, because I don't think I've seen anybody break it for any decent time. It's took 30 seconds for anybody to get there, to be I honest, but it is Boston. Break, if I recall correctly. Uh, Kutcher's trying to make it happen, as he finds two. Hancock with a third, and maybe, just maybe. And there it is. They get the break. History has been made. Yes, it, it's again only for 20 seconds, but then again, time was only going to a team in that hill for about 30. So not bad at all. The Vegas Legion. Not surpass. No, they're not going to surpass the Andrew. But it's 99 to 144 as we move back to a P1. Vegas are right there. God, Shabbat just proving why you just cannot break that hill easily. Holy. Big two in the feed for Boston. Williams shuts down Aguilar. And it's a nice pinch setup going on here for Boston. They're very well spread, one man each side, and they're actually going to spawn out towards Restaurant, which is probably more beneficial for the Vegas Legion here. And they can just line them up, and Kutcher has the lineup. He doesn't get, like, any of the kills, but he puts in about 50 million damage. Oh, all the gunfire. Oh god, it's a smoke up. Oh my god, Kutcher lost the gunfight in the smoke for the first time in about 10 gunfights. This... My man's my man's undefeated smoke gunfight well, streak. Vegas is... Legion with oh. the anti-smoke bubble. 
Oh, uh, you mean Boston? Because Kutcher's on. What? Vegas. Kutcher's on Vegas' team, so Boston would surely have the anti smoke dog. No? Uh, to P2! I saw orange shooting a lot of green, so. Boston. Yeah, and orange died. Trade's coming over the P2, it's a big double from Kutcher. And Vegas are gonna have to hop in here. That's one. That's the next, and it's a break. It's a break for Vegas. And we could see another lead change here. Vegas after. Alright, guys. Going uh, after Vegas being down break. by about we'll six. See you guys right? after the intermission. Uh, be right back. What? I'm kidding. Okay, good. <laughs> Don't head like that. I got pretty good puns at that. Lead change. Vegas back in the lead. Oh. Even though it is only one second in the lead, they are back in the lead. Who's going to get the spawns up to kitchen? 32 seconds left here. Is anybody going to spawn up to kitchen? Vegas are going to spawn balcony. And it's going to be a foot race. Of, who the is going to cook map. before the rest of this game? Let's see. Who is uh, going to cook? And that's... Who is that? They, oh, they're trying to make it through the door. And they actually both double chow instead of just running to the site. That's huge. It's going to be like Vegas. Las Vegas Legion are cooking tonight. Anderson steps in, gets the kill on pitcher. That could be big. Williams trades it out, though. Hancock shuts down Aguilar. Vegas can win it here. They can book their spot into the finals. On this hill. Contest coming in. Not the contest. Some fight needs to be dealt with. And it is dealt with. Another contest. But kills. Still. Austin was blue. very forgiving spawns. Still orange. Oh. Ten. Hancock with a double. Nine, and I, eight, I don't think they get the tech. Seven, I don't six, think they'll get the tech here. Five. I think Four, they need to rotate. Three, two, the contest will confirm that. that anyway. And on the rotation. Oh, look at that spawn. Shabbat is sprinting. Look at the spawns. Hancock is the sprinting. The spawns are huge G -G. for Vegas. And that's going to do it. That's going to be GG, surely. And there it is, Vegas. Winner, winner. Chicken Arguably dinner. Arguably with another upset. 3 1 Boston. Longan Wild Wavens versus Vegas. It's the Babel of the Elves. We see the Brits come the entire way. We're gonna see the Brits win it out, I think. I mean, they're world champions for a reason. In it. In it. You get it? In it? In it. Okay, give me 